to go up here onto the menu bar and click background. And then it offers you the option to change the color. So you click on this and you can change the color to any one of these colors here. If you like a gradient where it can change colors, you can click on gradient. A very cool feature is something called custom gradient or where you can create your own colorful background. So let's go with that because that's an interesting feature. When you're on custom gradient, you can click on these little boxes and they core the and this color will change. So this color right here uh, will change depending on if this box or this box is selected. So I'll go ahead and click on this one and I'm gonna do something sort of like a sunset. So I'm gonna start off with yellow and I'm gonna click on this box right here and you can see that this color changed. So I'm gonna click on red and that gives me a nice gradient there. You can also add stops along the way to add different colors. So I'm gonna go ahead and click add and you can see it added a little circle there and it's already highlighted. So this drop down menu color has changed. Um, let's see what happens when we add pink. Oh, that's nice. So let's say I like this, but I am not 100% on, um, I don't like it being linear. I can try radial and that's what happens. You can also change the position of the way it's coming in. Um, so I kind of like this where the yellow starts in the corner. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Um, another option, if you would like to choose an image, you can click it, choose an image and then whatever images that you have, you can choose from. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and click done. Um, but before I do that, I did want it to apply to all of my slides that I have. So I'm going to click add to theme and then it applied to all of my slides and then I'm done. And that is how you add a background.